Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori. I'm crazy hair. I got wet hair. Just got out of the shower. It is Friday. I know I missed our Wednesday video. I've been super busy. But I'll get this up. Um, I have a Dollar Tree haul and I wanted to show you something so fun. So I bought, I have it sitting on a saucer, but I bought this at the Dollar Tree. It's the basil, the buzzy kit. And look, it's working. I've never had good luck with these, but I bought a grow lamp because I don't get a lot of sunshine. I'm going to have basil. I'm so excited. I had to share and I wanted to let you know that it truly does work. I got to fix that. Okay. I went to the Dollar Tree. I got some fun stuff. I want to share. It's not a big haul, but I should have a bigger one next time because they're coming out with their spring. What is that? I fixed it. Their spring stuff or summer stuff. First, I got a second pot. I don't know why I didn't buy it too because I have two hanging baskets in the window and I want them to match. I've already used one of them and this is the second one. I haven't transplanted yet. I also got more basil seeds because I'm apparently a farmer. Who knew? Okay. I got to sort down here. I have a mess. So let us, let us see what we have. Um, I grabbed some of these. They are Guru Natural Flossers and I love them. I usually get the placards, but we want, hi Luna. Luna's here visiting. Say hi. Yeah. Um, her mom, Sarah, who is my niece, this is not for you, is on a little weekend getaway. So we went, I was very curious about these. They're not for you. See? Um, they are mint. And they're your regular flosser on that end, but they have a like a rubber pick. So you can like get between your teeth. And it has like grooves on it to get that plaque. So I'm going to give these a try. So I thought that was fun. Snacks, like I do. Um, oh yeah, so I've been buying some travel stuff because I have two trips coming up, one very soon and then one in a couple months. But I am going overseas, I'm going to Ireland in July and I wasn't sure if what the mask mandate is, I don't know. Honestly, I saw these and it was the last pack. I'm like, I'm just gonna grab them and throw them in my suitcase. I know we're not masking here, but I don't know. And if I get sick while I'm traveling, like if I catch a cold or something, I wanna be respectful and wear a mask. So, and um, I don't know if these, these are not N45s, but they are the medical, the medical mask. I just grabbed the two pack. You should always have them with you in this day and age. I grabbed some of this Dole brand. This is new to my Dollar Tree. I've never seen them have the Dole drink packets. And this is peach mango. Spoiler alert, I've been drinking these at work and they are delicious. I love them. So I grabbed another box. I just grabbed, you know, the drinks when I see them. And then I'm putting together for travel for my trip to Canada and Ireland, a little first aid kit, just a small, I just need band-aids. Um, like alcohol swipes, just little things. And so I grabbed some band-aids. These are just fun. Um, the fun thing is that is the shape of the band-aid. I'll just throw one or two. And then I did get some different ones for blisters because I'll be doing a lot of walking, but these are just fun to have in my little first aid kit, which I can show you how I put it together. You'll see most of the items. I need to pick up a few more. Um, oh, I found one of these beauty blush, beauty blenders. I don't know if I love the Dollar Tree blender itself. I'll have to try it, but I really wanted this because of the travel. So if I bring my beauty blender, I can put it in here after I, it's damp and it won't, those are air holes. So it won't get all over my luggage and it will breathe and it was a dollar. So I thought, even if I don't love this beauty blender, I'll use it for crafting to blend, to blend paint or something. Um, we'll see, I've never tried it, but I definitely wanted this for my suitcase because that's how we roll. Um, oh, I got some lip oil to try. I've never tried this. I don't know what the oil is. Mineral oil. 
My lips have been really dry and I think I'm overusing my Burt's Bees peppermint and I think it's drying them out worse. I mean, I'm not giving up my chapstick, but i am been putting, um, trying to come up with a different product. I'm trying to open it. I, you would think after how many years I've been doing this that I would have a pair of scissors handy, but that's not really the case. Um, what are you guys up to for your Easter weekend? Anybody got big plans? Let me know. Also, while I'm fighting with this, make sure you like and subscribe because it really does help my channel. I did remember a trash bag today. Okay, so this is just, it says it's Juice Bar Grape Lip Oil. So we're going to see. I don't like things that melt into my mouth, if that makes sense. Feels good. Definitely, definitely great. It's not colored, but it feels nice. So let's see by the end of the video if it dries my lips out. Okay. And then I'm going to be doing table mate gifts. So in Canada, I'm going to a cross stitching retreat and there are going to be seven people at our table. So I grab these little bags they fold up like a little shopping bag and I put treats in them for my table mates like little presents and I got these bubbles to put in there because I thought these would be fun we can blow bubbles um and I got that and then I have other stuff I made some stuff okay oh this is heavy what is in here I've also been stocking up on some cleaning product which I think is what's in here yes okay so they have this fresh step for the cat litter deodorizing crystals and I want to try it. It says you put a quarter of a cup. <coughs> Hi, what do you need? I know. Oh, <coughs> no, we're not barking. You, it is not for you either. She thinks it's all for her. You put a quarter of a cup of this in your kitty litter and it's supposed to make it fresh. We'll see. I grabbed two of those um, to try. I grab a Mr. Clean Magic Eraser because there's a black spot on my car. And I, I don't mind the Dollar Tree one, but I prefer the, the Mr. Clean one or whatever. Um, I grabbed some of this. I really liked this dishwashing soap. It's peppermint sage. And I actually take it out of here and put it in a clear glass container that I have. But I like the smell and it does a good job washing my dishes. So I stocked, I needed some stuff. And then I got some Oxy for my laundry because it um, we're getting into the spring and summer where I ride my bike a lot and sometimes I get smelly in my bike clothing and this really helps kind of deodorize the um, it's a specific fabric so I can't use scent beads with it it's like Wickaway sport fabric so no fabric softener no scent beads but I think the OxyClean is fine so that was um, for spring Oh, tomato sauce. Just cause. I know. Just a couple more things, guys. I told you I was very low on, they were very low on stock at my stores, but they have been for some time. Although last night I went to a different store that's really tiny near me and they never really have anything, but surprisingly they had something. Um, I grabbed this to try. You put your soap in here and then you push it out and you scrub because I use these a lot like I have a, a bamboo one that I use on like my air fryer and stuff and I really like how they work so I'm going to try this one and put some soap in it and see how that how that goes um oh I grabbed two more I really liked this peach mango Peach seems to be the flavor because Dole came out with peach mango and then I think the Crush brand came out with a peach and I have something else. Oh, I got Hydrolite, no, Liquid IV. It's a powder drink mix with electrolytes and stuff in it and I actually got it for my trip overseas because flying on the airplane you get very dehydrated So and I'm on a very long flight. So I bought some Liquid IV to drink on the plane but I can drink it whenever but that's why I bought it. And it was in peach. All that to tell you it was in peach. Okay. 
Then the last two things, let's do our, well, I'll show you and then we'll do our thumbnail. I grabbed these. So the Bic brand, I got the washable markers and I wanted to see what these were all about. And these are long lasting color, break resistant crayons, no wrap, no mess, clean hands can be easily sharpened. And it was very intriguing to me. And you get, it's a 24 pack, but they're, they're super long crayons, right? I don't have anything to color on, do I? How about a tag? I mean, they're creamy like a Crayola, which is nice. Yeah, they color good. You can sharpen them. The kids don't have to worry about paper, getting the papers off. Fun colors. I'm, apparently, I'm collecting all of the Bic stuff, but I thought that was super fun. And these are hefty crayons, too. So I have my other one here because I'm keeping an eye out. So these are the washable markers and apparently there's colored pencils and crayons. So I just need to find the colored pencils. These would be great for back to school. I mean, they're different than Crayola, but, and heads up, my lips are not dry. They are still moist and they don't feel crusty or anything. So I'm thinking that's good. And then the last thing I got for vacation these are new. These have to be new. I've not ever seen these in Dollar Tree before. And I am obsessed with um, Tide to Go pens and Shout Wipes because I get coffee everywhere all the time. These are like a stain remover wipe. They're just like a Shout Wipe. You get 12 in here, which is fantastic. I like that they're individually packaged. Let's see what they look like. Yeah, they're individually packaged stain wipes. So if you spill something on your clothing, it's a pre-treater. Rub it on, whatever, your coffee, and it helps it not stain. And I, I live by these, so if these work, I'm going to be so excited. It does say do not flush. I don't know why I would flush them, but whatever. Um, yeah, for one shiny dollar and 25 cents, this is a fantastic bargain if you can find it. Keep them in your car. I keep one in my purse. Um, my backpack. I keep one with me. I need to put one in my work bag because last week when I was working at my part-time job, I got mustard all over my white shirt. I got it out, but this would have been handy. So yeah, that's everything I got at the Dollar Tree this week. Like I said, it's a short but fun video. I hope you enjoy. I don't know when this will be going up. I'm kind of busy today and I'm working tonight. So, and I already have a video going up tonight that you will see, which is an exciting one. Um, it's all about travel items. I think that's tonight. Yes, it's my Amazon video that'll be up tonight. But I want you to enjoy. Have a fantastic day. I've got errands to run. And um, have a happy Easter if you celebrate. Bye.